This part 9 of C-Sharp interview questions video series. In this video, we'll answer this interview question. Can you call an abstract method from an abstract class constructor? The answer is yes. Let's look at an example. Let's first create an abstract class. Let's call it customer. Let's include an abstract method. Let's call it print. Let's now include a constructor. And within the constructor, let's invoke the print method. Now, notice that we are invoking this abstract print method within the constructor of this abstract class. So, can you call an abstract method from an abstract class constructor? The answer is yes. Now, the abstract method within the abstract class doesn't have any implementation. So, what's the use of calling this abstract method from the constructor of the abstract class. To answer this question, let's create another class. Let's call it savings customer and let's make this class inherit from the abstract customer class. Let's provide the implementation for the abstract print method. Let's just print a message to the console saying that this is savings customer class print method invoked. All right. Now let's create another class and let's call this class corporate customer. And this class is also inheriting from the same abstract class customer. And let's change the message to corporate customer class print method invoked. And now within our main method, let's create an instance of our savings customer class. Let's call it SC equals new savings customer. And similarly, let's create an instance for corporate customer class. All right. So within the main method, we are just creating instances of the derived classes. Now let's run this and see what's going to happen. Look at that. Savings customer class print method invoked. Corporate customer class print method invoked. Now, are we invoking the print method explicitly here? No, we are not. So how is that getting called? Now, look at these classes savings customer class and this cust abstract customer class, they are related with each other through inheritance. Now, we know that when we create an instance of a derived class, the parent class constructor is automatically called. And for savings customer, the parent class is customer class. And within the constructor of that class, we are invoking the print method. So this overridden print method will be get called automatically. So if you want the abstract method to be invoked automatically, whenever an instance of the class that is derived from the abstract class is created, then we would call it in the constructor of the abstract class. That's it for today. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.